It's small and it could save your life. Still to come tonight on News 4 at 5, Doreen Gensler has details about a new treatment for a deadly heart condition and it only takes 60 minutes to perform. Tonight, a new treatment for a deadly heart condition that affects millions of Americans. Doreen Gensler is here with the details of this new procedure that takes just an hour to perform and it doesn't involve any drugs. Doreen? Hi, Wendy and Jim. We're talking about atrial fibrillation. AFib is what some call it. It's an irregular heartbeat that can lead to a stroke. Well, now doctors are implanting a tiny device that's reducing that risk and helping patients get off of their medications. Atrial fibrillation makes you drained, takes all your energy away. Because Connie Wiley says atrial fibrillation has not only left her feeling exhausted and sick, it's also caused her to have three strokes. But the medication to stop those strokes has caused internal bleeding. So it's A or B. Which way do you want to die? You know. Nearly three million Americans suffer from this same condition, but now this little piece of metal and mesh recently approved by the Food and Drug Administration could help prevent the condition. It's called the Watchman Heart Device. Dr. Ron Waxman is an interventional cardiologist at the MedStar Heart and Vascular Institute. The idea was to see whether we can spare the uh, blood thinners by basically eliminating the source of the clot. The doctor uses a catheter through the groin to implant the device into an area of the heart called the left atrial appendage. This is where blood clots most commonly form. While it won't cure the atrial fibrillation, the idea is to stop those clots from escaping. That's like a filter that won't allow the clots to travel all the way up. Once Dr. Waxman concluded. says most patients should be able to come off of their medications within 45 days. Connie Wiley underwent the procedure okay. about two weeks ago, and she says she's already feeling better. She's back to her favorite hobbies, gardening and spending time with her dog, Bella. I'm feeling more and more and more energetic. I'm getting a lot accomplished that I couldn't before. I never thought it would happen that way, but it did. Bottom line, this device won't cure atrial fibrillation, but it can help to prevent one of its most dangerous side effects, stroke. Wendy and Jim, this is something that could help a lot of people. It's very cool.